your heart is right, you can build a strong marriage that is now a role model for many couples across the world. Hmm. It's amazing what can be accomplished with a maximizing attitude. And each one of us can do more right now in our relationship to maximize. Amen. Do you hear me? Amen. Amen. Now, one of the things you can do in your marriage is start doing something that you ain't did before. Mm -hmm. You know the things that you have done and single people as well in order to bring your relationship closer to your children. Amen. You don't need a man. Amen. Woman. Amen. Child of God. Amen. I got one good amen over here. Amen. I can tell who real up in here. I'm just quiet as a church eyes mouth. Single woman. I guess my revelation from the word of God. Amen. Amen. That you don't need a man. Amen. To bring about what God can bring about. Amen. Amen. Mary, Hallelujah. Well, is the one that was single. Amen. Oh yes, mm -hmm. that God drove up on Mary and said, "Mary, you're gonna have a baby." He said, "You can tell she ain't had sex at midnight." Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hallelujah. Because she asked, "How is this thing gonna happen?" Amen. Many women single ask the question, "How something gonna change in their life?" And they don't look to God for changing. They'll find somebody, a man, to help them do it. But can I help you tonight, baby? Yeah, yeah, Amen. Yeah, yeah. Mary said, how I'm going to do it? The angel said, the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. 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 Don't come up on you. And you will perceive your deliverance. You will perceive what you need for your children. Yeah, yeah. You will perceive the strength you need to have to become a maximizer Hallelujah. and not a weak person. Wait on the Lord. Amen. He'll make you a maximizer. Amen. Amen. You won't have to feel lonely. Amen. He'll walk with you like you walk with Jeremiah. Glory. And he'll help you come through yes. without you fed. Can you say that? Amen. I wish the single people would get this tonight. Amen. The Holy Ghost is your companion. Amen. Amen. Yes, you. Amen. You falling apart because you're lonely. You're not lonely. You just have not visited God yet. Amen. Amen. If you visit God, you won't be lonely no more. Amen. Amen. Mother Johnny, give some wisdom up in here. Give some. <laughs> Help some of you young ladies to get some wisdom up in here. You don't have to give up to give out. Amen. Because anytime you give up, you're giving out. Amen. Amen. You lose what you are, and what you are, amen, is what was God. Amen. And when you do that, you're losing who you are. Yes, Lord. Let God do what he got to do, yes, single God. person, in yes. your life. He know how to become your husband, yes. your father, yes. and your best friend yes. at the yes. same time. Hallelujah. Y'all can let God build your life, amen, so you can learn how to have stuff without a man giving it to you. But when your man come, he got what you already got. Different attitude and a different approach 
while facing the same circumstances you now encounter. Your attitude can change based on the conviction you have in God's word. Uh huh. It is a matter of choice. It is a matter of choice. It's a matter of choice. Amen. This is not denial. It is a choice. And the Bible said that we have the right to choose. Mm -hmm. I mean, no, God told Joshua to choose. Amen. Joshua told the rest of the camp to choose. Amen. Can you say amen? amen. Who are you going to serve? Amen. Now watch this. We cannot control the trouble that comes into our life because if we had it our own way, we would not have any trouble. Amen. Amen. We can't control the trouble that comes, but we can control our response to the trouble. Mm -hmm. Do you always answer back anger? Do you respond back to a person with anger when something intensifies your moment? Do you lose all of a sudden, amen, the joy turning into a raging, snapping person? Do you have the small egg mouth when things suddenly change? <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, you listen to me. So you, I'm listening, Pastor. I'm listening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know it, you tell them quite when it's really it's just getting quiet, just like the air you will stop moving. <laughs> <laughs> you get real quiet on the board. <laughs> you respond to every situation. I think you have to really monitor yourself how you respond to certain things that show up that you dislike. Amen. 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 God, there is some surprising things can happen. There is some surprising things can happen. Amen. Absolutely shocking that time. Amen. It'll make you draw back and say, what? And it'll almost make some of them cup. Yes. Mm -hmm. Amen. I'm telling you right now, it, 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 it make you really want to rack up some stuff. So that is some shocking things can come up on us and make us really want to act out real, real bad. And I'll be frankly honest with you. Amen. I just went through something that I could have really exploded Amen. to the max. <laughs> to the max, yes, God. And thanks be to God that has helped my <laughs> It's how I had to respond to the situation. As I listened to his voice say, you don't say nothing. Keep your mouth shut. The devil was saying, you can do mm, 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 mm. <laughs> I felt like doing mm, 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 mm. <laughs> God, peace came over me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And kept me cool. Amen. If we just stop sometimes <laughs> before we respond to the situation. Amen. The wrong way. Just stop sometime Amen. and catch yourself and let God respond for you. Amen. You won't mess up the moment, the atmosphere with the one you're in the house with. Amen. What is the worst thing that you hate the most that your kids say to you? How they answer you. What is the most thing that you hate the most the way they answer you? Now? Huh? 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 What? I don't know. I don't know. Me. Me. <laughs> Even being grown, there's some things that we respond to each other that is not appropriate and not polite. When something that we don't like, amen, special married people that be around people, each other all the time. I think absolutely we be around each other, don't respect each other enough to respect the answer in a polite way. 
Amen. And you notice how we don't do it outside. You notice that when you don't do it around other people out there? That you, you're around somebody that don't know you got a different face on. <laughs> Next time, don't be a hypocrite. <laughs> Other words, I'm only calling you that. I'm not trying to offend you, but don't be a hypocrite. Because if you can't do it to the one you win, you shouldn't do it at all. Amen. And praise the Lord on that. And praise the Lord on that. Cause that I believe we we talk. I'm um, just being real. Now you being a real hypocrite, amen. Because God has fixed your emotions through Jesus Christ. Amen. He has fixed your responding to situation through Christ. Look at Christ on the cross. He wasn't cussing them out. You done jack me up. I'm jacking all y'all up. Y'all wait three days later. When I come back, I'm going to jack. Jesus wasn't responding. <laughs> he wasn't talking about jacking up everybody and putting them on that cross. He didn't even respond. Amen. Amen. But you know you crucified when you don't respond in the wrong way. Amen. And that you respond like, Father, forgive them. But they know not what they do. Jesus. And we look and say, I'm not Jesus. <laughs> 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 I'm only human. No, you're not human. <laughs> you're born again, washed in the blood of Jesus, full of the Holy Ghost, and got the power of God to do just that. I forgive you. Amen. 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 Hello. Amen. Jesus did not respond like we do. Amen. And we don't even be hanging on the cross. Amen. We just had a bad day. Yeah. They walk in the house and the kids make, nah, shut up, pop <laughs> Oh, don't come talk to me today. Just wait. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, baby. Okay, what you need? You know, it's it's easy to, to calm yourself down and bring out a polite word. Amen. You don't have to go to the extent of your temper. Amen. Amen. What makes things fall apart is the trouble that hit it. Amen. Got it. Yeah. Zero. Thank you. Let me finish this. He done gave me. <laughs> if you respond properly to the challenges in life, we won't have the trouble long because we can overcome by faith. Last scripture for the night. First John five four. Can you say amen? I must finish this tomorrow night. Amen. I might call my conference next year Maximizing Family Life. Amen. Amen. Today. Amen. That bit I can really feed you. Amen. 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 First John 5 4, you there? Amen. Remember when I just said if we respond properly to the challenges in life, we won't have that trouble, that trouble alone because we can overcome by faith. Yeah. Watch this, you ready? First John 5, 4, last scripture. Mm -hmm. Because everyone who has been born from God has won the victory over the world. Yeah. Our faith is what wins the victory over the world. Amen. Every one of you that are born of God, even on streaming. You have won the victory. You're not going to get the victory. You already got the victory. Amen. Do you hear me? Most of the time, Satan informs us of what our next level is going to look like. Are you already in your next level? Ah, he informed us that things has changed in our life. Ah, he informed us that there's something suddenly shifting to your direction. He's a messenger that encounters your life and lets you know you got better on the other side. Amen. He encounters your life and lets you know you have already won. Amen. Is anybody in this house? Yes, so if you so-called, amen, have problem tomorrow, just lift your hands up and say, 
victory already mine. Amen. Amen. Amen.
Can I get a witness? Amen. Hallelujah. Ready? Amen. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare God's covenant blessings over my family. I declare God's covenant blessings over my family. My family will not be cut off. My family will not be cut off. My family will live and not die. My family will live and not die. We come near the most high thing. Are the most holy thing. The most holy thing. My family will share the inheritance of the tribe of Judah. My family will share the inheritance. Say like your family gonna do it. You want them to do it. My family will share the inheritance of the tribe of Judah. That's said it real bad. Let's see. Let's see. Can I get some more auction out of you? Yeah, like your tired. Let's say that again. My family will share the inheritance of the tribe of Judah. With your voice loud. My family will share the inheritance of the tribe of Judah. My family like the families of Issachar. My family like the families of Issachar. Full of mighty men of valor. Full of mighty men of valor. The Lord will be with my family. The Lord will be with my family. Let the inheritance of the Lord come upon my family. Let the inheritance of the Lord come upon my family. As it did upon the tribe of Israel. As it did upon the tribe of Israel. The Lord will greatly increase the house of the fathers in my family. The Lord will greatly increase the house of the fathers of my family. My family will give glory and strength. My family will give glory and strength to the Lord. To the Lord. The Lord set the poor in my family on high. The Lord set the poor in my family on high. And far from affliction. And far from affliction. It makes their families like a flock. And makes their families like a flock. My family hears the word of the Lord. My family hears the word of the Lord. The Lord will take my family in the night. The Lord will take my family in the night. And watch their stripes. And watch their stripes. They will be baptized. They will be baptized. My family is blessed. My family is blessed. The Lord will bless those who bless my family. The Lord will bless those who bless my family. And curse those who curse my family. And curse those who curse my family. My family will serve in the tabernacle of God. My family will serve in the tabernacle of God. My family will multiply and increase like the tribe of Judah. My family will multiply and increase like the tribe of Judah. The ark of the presence of the Lord. The ark of the presence of the Lord. The Dwells with my family. The blessing of the Lord. The blessing of the Lord. Upon the household in my family. Upon the household in my family. My family worship before God. My family worship before God. The solitary ones in my family. The solitary ones in my family. Will be brought back. Will be brought back. Those who are bind. Those who are bind. Will be brought into prosperity. Will be brought into prosperity. The Lord will be God over my family. The Lord will be God over my family. And we will be his people. And we will be his people. My family will not be seduced. My family will not be seduced. And sold by witches. And sold by witches. And harlots. And harlots. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My family are the sons of the prophets. My family are the sons of the prophets. And of the covenant God made with Abraham. And of the covenant God made with Abraham. The seed of my family will be blessed. The seed of my family will be blessed. We are a family of high priests. We are a family of high priests. The word of salvation has been sent to my family. The word of salvation has been sent to my family. The Lord will send angels to accompany my family. The Lord will send angels to accompany my family. The Lord will prosper my family's ways. The Lord will prosper my family's ways. The descendants of my family will spread. The descendants of my family will spread. Out like the dust of the earth. Out like the dust of the earth. And we will be blessed. And we will be blessed. The Lord will deal well with my family. The Lord will deal well with my family. The Lord will bring my family out of abundance of Egypt. The Lord will bring my family out of abundance of Egypt. My family strengthens the kingdom. My family strengthens the kingdom. Because they walk in the way of David and Solomon. Because they walk in the way of David and Solomon. The Lord will set my family at their throne. The Lord will set my family at their throne. At the entrance of Jerusalem and the city of Judah. At the entrance of Jerusalem and the city of Judah. The Lord is married to my family. The Lord is married to my family. And will bring us to Zion. And will bring us to Zion. My family will never be like the Gentiles. 
Gentile. My family will never be like the Gentile. Who serve wood and stone. Who serve wood and stone. Let there not be any among my family. Let there not be any among my family. Who will turn their heart from the Lord our God. Who will turn their heart from the Lord our God. Let there be no root in my family. Let there be no root in my family. Burn bitterness and wormwood. Burn bitterness and wormwood. And in the name of Jesus Christ. And in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree. I decree. I decree. The covenant of God. The covenant of God. And His word. And His word. Over my family. Over my family. I call the heavens. I call the heavens. And the earth. And the earth. To receive my decree. To receive my decree. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. supernatural start doing things in your family Amen. that you have not seen before. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.